Ooh. All right, this is one of my favorite parts of the day when I'm driving to the gym, because this is my time that I don't have any distractions, I don't have any phone calls, no one's trying to get in touch with me, I don't have any conference calls. I'm visualizing the workout. This is my pre-workout ritual. Now, it's a little bit later in the day. It's uh, just gone 3.30 here. I try not to have any caffeine during this time. I usually don't have a pre-workout. I have my mix your own system, like with the HydroCharge, branch chain amino acids, glutamine, etc. But now I have a new product, which is pre-cage stim-free. A lot of you have been asking, when are we gonna come out with a pre-workout stim-free? So we've got it now, because not everybody wants to mix their own supplement. So what I usually do, about 40 minutes before I get to the gym, which it takes me that to drive there, I have my pre-workout, I start sipping it on the way to the gym. Not only am I getting the influx of the stim-free stim nutrients into my body to get me focused, to get me pumped, to get me primed for my workout, I'm preparing myself mentally as well. Remember, a supplement is just a supplement. It's not gonna push you to go to the gym. You have to want it bad enough. So while you drive into the gym, Put your phone on silent, no distractions. Try not to get caught up in conversation, being on um, you know, your hands free or anything like that. Use this time to visualize your workout. Visualize the clothes that you're wearing for that particular body part, the sets, the reps, what the steel feels like in your hand. What's the stress and load gonna feel like on that particular muscle group when you get there? So when you do arrive to the gym, you just go through the motions, the pain, the anguish, the stress, the weakness, the excuse, you've already abolished that and you visualize that workout. Now, if you're training later in the afternoon, like I am today, or in the evening, or maybe you split up your body parts so you train in the morning and in the evening, the Stim Free is gonna be perfect. I'm a slow caffeine metabolizer and I quantify my sleep. I want quality sleep. So if I take the pre-caged in the afternoon, that's stim free. It doesn't affect my sleep at all, but I still get the best workout that I possibly can. So anyway, with that said, let's head to the gym. So now I'm in the gym 40 minutes after I started drinking my pre-cage. It's completely in my system now. I can feel it in there. However, I need to encourage it into my bloodstream by getting the body parts moving a little bit. So before I get into this workout, I like to do a few warm-up sets first. And that's not just to get the synovial fluid into my joints or the blood into the muscle. It's to get the blood pumping around the body and into the brain. Because remember, even though the pre-caged is stimulant-free, there is still a neuro-focused complex of ingredients that will help me stay focused within this workout. But remember, it's just a supplement and you need to encourage that supplement by getting the blood flow into the body and getting yourself psyched up at the same time, specifically on the movement that you're about to start with. For me, today, it's bench press. So I'll warm up with a few sets before I start stacking wheels on there. Another thing I like to do before my sets, I just like to do a bit of box breathing. So. So I breathe in for a couple of seconds, hold it for a couple of seconds, exhale for a couple of seconds. I'll do that for about 10 seconds total because what you can do is provide alkalinity into your body, which allows you to buffer the pain to a certain degree. So there's a guy called Wim Hof that does this before he submerges himself in ice. And it is shown to increase your pH up to about eight, which allows you to just completely buffer out a lot of the pain when you're getting into the ice. And the same applies when you're getting into the gym to help you remove yourself of that pain. There's so many things that you can do taking a pre-cage stimulant free. You can train like chest in the morning and come back in the evening and do triceps. So I can take the pre-caged with the pure calf organic caffeine in the morning 
and then come back in the late afternoon or evening and hit a workout for that smaller muscle group or whatever, that secondary muscle group, but take the stimulant free so it doesn't affect my sleep. Because remember, your recovery dictates your performance. A lot of people don't look at sleep too much as being an essential part in your physical evolution. If you think about it, you can live without food for a couple of weeks. You can live without fluid for about 10 days. I'm generalizing, but you can only live without sleep for several days. That's how important sleep is to you. So in the evening, if I'm working out, taking no caffeine is an essential part, especially if I'm a slow caffeine metabolizer, to my recovery. And also, if you're in the evening, like training ba in basketball, you're going for a run, um, you know, any other activity, MMA, that you want to take a stimulant-free pre-workout, stim-free pre-cage is perfect for you now. All right, guys, you can get your stimulant-free pre-cage right now exclusively at bodybuilding.com.